Hey guys, welcome to Safi Mixed. In this video, I will let you know how to plot your data in which the x-axis of the plot is labeled with text. For example, the names of months. So to do that, I first import my data that contain text and numerics. For example, here is my data. The first column contains this. The first column contains the names of months up to and the second column contains numerical data so uh, i import the data by clicking the import button and then close this window now you see here i have two files the text data this is the name of the file in my folder in csv months so uh, this file contains the name of the months and this file contains the numerics data and what i do i first uh, label my x axis by giving name it months and uh, i change the mode from here from numeric to labels right and then i leave the rest of the things as they are and the same i do for the y axis so the y axis is numeric but i just label it with cell that contains the numeric with cells. And then I add the XY widget. On the XY widget, I add X data, so there is available only numeric data CSV cell. I leave for the time being this as it is, and I fill the Y data with cells. And you see, now the data from the uh, file C switch cell is uh, written on the y axis. So uh, I come down to the labels, and in the labels, the months <clears throat> file is available, and I put that in the months. Okay, now I come back to the x axis and I add the cell data. Now, the cell data, when added, the x is uh, graduated, but you see here is but you see here some things that you may not like because the November is put first, June, February, January. These are not in order. So this is a problem. And the points are marked with their months. So the number has the minimum value. Therefore, it is put first. And then we have December, which has the maximum value is and is not visible at this position. Uh, I come to this point how to fix it first. But first, I want to change the limits of the y-axis so that all the points be inside this area, be on the frame. And that I do by coming to here and uh, I change the minimum value from R2 to 2,500. And then the maximum value I put from 7,500. If I enter these values, now you see uh, the, the number is inside the frame, but the value is locating exactly at the origin point, and the same is true for the symbol. Now, in order to put these things in order and keep the labeling in ascending or descending orders, what I do, I add another file, that is, I want to cheat the software. And so what I do, I click on one of these two files and uh, click on edit data. And on edit data, this is now important, I come here and I add another data set and that should be numeric. I add numeric data set and I keep on, and I can change the name, but it is not important, it be new data set. Let's, and in the first slot, I add one, then I come down to the second one, I put two, and I put the numbers up to 12, adding new column and uh, adding new rows and adding numbers up to 12. So you do that for yourself, I'm just... So you see here, I have added numerics, I have added numbers from one to 12, and I import this data set as well. So it is now imported and the data set is over here. 
So now I close this window and then I come back to the XY widget and in the X data, I change this value to new data set. And no sooner I do that, all the numbers are put in the right order, January, February, March, April, and now the uh, points are lab, the points are also labeled with. So this way you can add text to your x-axis in views. Thanks for watching.